I'm Sharon with Water Beads Design. Today we're going to have fun and make an uh, ideal centerpiece for like a beach party or a picnic or just take the beach home with you. Kids always love to bring some shells home with them or collect them when they're there so we're going to put them to good use. I practiced with this little one just so we get an idea of what the colors will look like but it's going to be look like we're underwater. So let's see how we do it. First, we'll need to put some sand, or you can have crushed rock, or you can even just go to the uh, craft store and buy some crushed shells. Today, I'm using this crushed white rock. Make sure that you, if you have the sand or the rock, that you wash it off first. Otherwise, all the dust will float up and you don't want that to happen. So let's put this in here. That looks pretty good. There we go. Now I'm going to pour just a little bit of water in here to begin with. This will help me when I put the shells in. Okay, now with the shells, and we're designing this, think about whether you want this on the center of the table so you can see it all the way around, or if you just want it in the on one side so when you walk past it you can see. This bucket is interesting. It's plastic. It's mainly for an ice bucket. But with this, what we're going to do is add these shells. And I love this because, if you can see, it's magnified just the way the plastic was shaped. So let's put some more of these shells in. So every direction when we're sitting at the table, we'll be able to look at these shells. Let's put a few more. The kids will love doing this with you. You know how the kids love to collect these shells. Let's put a few more and take a look. Kind of fit them so you can see them. How about a couple more? Oh, that's kind of interesting. Let's put that right there. Okay, I think that's enough. Next, we're going to put our clear water beads. These I've already soaked. I actually soaked them overnight, so they're all set. I'm going to pour these in. Remember, they bounce. You kind of stand back and just see where you want them. That's why I did this one to practice so I know what I'm doing, I hope. Okay, a little bit more. Very good. Next, we'll try the turquoise. Turquoise, I love it. All right, there they go. Isn't that beautiful? It's beginning to look like you're underwater, doesn't it? Oh, I like those. Great, but even more. Now for the top, a little bit darker. These are pretty blue. We'll just put some of those on top. We're almost done. Oh, that is gorgeous. Can you look underneath and see what that looks like? That is so pretty from different directions. To make you look at it a little better, we can always add a light. Now this is a different light. This one comes in all different colors. Each time you press it, it comes in green, blue, red combinations. So let's try one more. Yeah, blue and green, that'll be pretty. Let's just see what happens with that. Put that in there, lighten it up a little bit. And we're going to add a few shells around here. Put a few napkins, a little sand toys. And